ogre named Shrek, who lived with his parents in a bog by a tree. It was a pretty nasty place, but she was happy because ogres like nasty. On his seventh birthday, the little ogre's parents sat him down to talk, just as all ogre parents had for hundreds of years before.
<laughs> you mean the story of Sam the Big Bad Wolf? <laughs>
Say, uh, did you hear what they said, man? This place is going stuffing. We gotta join forces now, otherwise you're gonna lock me up. And I cannot go back in the cage. You know, I don't know if I mentioned this or not, but I once did six years in solitary for impersonating a pinata. <laughs> <laughs> And if you don't mind me saying, if that don't work, then your breath will certainly get the job done. <laughs> Donkey, take a look at me. What am I? Uh, really green? No! <laughs> I'm an ogre, you know. Grab your torch and pitchforks. Doesn't that bother you? Nope. Really? Really, really. <laughs> oh. Can I like you? What's your name? Um, Shrek. Shrek? Well, you know what I like about you, Shrek? You got that whole, I don't care what anybody thinks me thing going on. <laughs> I like that, Shrek. I respect it. You all right? Oh, good. I'm glad. Goodbye. Well, hey, 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 you gotta let me go with you. You don't know what it's like to be considered a freak. Well, maybe you do, but that's why we gotta stick together. Just, no, no, don't uh, speak, don't speak, don't <laughs> speak. Just hear me out. I might surprise you, I'll be a friend when others despise you. Don't roll your eyes, stop with the moving. You need a pat, and my calendar's open. I'll bring you soup when you feel congested. I'll bail you out when you get arrested. I got your back for my butt when things get scary. And I'll shave it when it gets hairy.
arrested. Freaks on every corner. I have them all arrested. Hey, naughty, 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 no. You gotta work. You didn't pass inspection. We all have our standards. I will have perfection. And so. Expendable. <laughs> Here we go, Duloc. 
We have a winner! Congratulations, Ogre. You won the honor setting forth on a noble quest. But we already are a quiz. To get my smart uh, bag. Yes, and you've nearly completed it. All you have is one itty bitty teeny weeny yellow polka dotted quest, and I'll give you back to the teacher's walk. And what is this yellow polka dotted quest? Oh, Walter! <laughs> Dossier of Her Royal Highness. Hero uh, Dulong, your queen is on her way! <laughs> That was weird. Not as weird as you agree to go on this quest. What do you know about Rich Rudy Pinson? I've read the stories. Yeah, and I've read his fourth page, but I maybe no hockey player. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, there's a dragon and a tower. How hard can it be? Oh, how hard can it be? I bet you be fit to find out, I'll tell you that. What's it say about the princess anyway? Well, it says here that she likes pina coladas and getting caught in the rain. Ooh, <laughs> she sounds <laughs> fun, with it. Um, well, it also says that she's been locked in a tower since she was seven. Oh, what a thing. All the long since she was seven years old? Seven years old. Seven years old? <laughs> that are so weird. Man, that's a long, I'm like 52 in those years, man. That's a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Will be 
Big Bob Run here for your small thing. You know, pull some of that oak stuff on here. Toronto him lays siege to his fortress. You know, the whole oak tree. For your information, Doc, there's a lot more to ogres than people think. Exactly. Ogres? Are like onions. Oh, they stink? Yes. No. Oh, they make you crack. No. Oh, you leave them out of the sun, they start getting all brown and start spreading little white hands. No. <laughs> Donkey. Layers. Onions have layers. Ogres have layers. Onions. Ah, uh, you get that? We both have layers. Oh, okay. So you both got layers. <laughs> you know, not everybody like onions. Donkey. <laughs> Puffets. Everybody like parfaits and they got layers. I mean, have you ever met somebody who say, hey, let's go get some parfaits, and they say, hell no, I like no parfaits. I mean, parfaits are delicious, man. I don't <laughs> care, Donkey. Ogres are not like parfaits. You know, parfaits may be the most delicious thing on the whole damn planet. You know, this may turn into the longest day of my entire life. Ooh, Ooh well, I got the perfect remedy for that. Oh, no, Donkey, please. What you ask for, man? I'm, I'm sorry. begging you. Sing a song, yes, the travel song When you gotta go somewhere Cause the fun is getting there Yeah! Oh, what the heck, I must confess, I love a road trip Sing a song, hit the trail Forget the map, forget the guide Before you know it, you may try to be And all I need all along Is a bath and a pile and a song So I'm singing Why me? Why me? Tell me what was my crime. Uh, we are strolling boots. A cat, he has a parrot more annoying than mine. Hey, look at a cat who's wearing boots. That's crazy. Why me? Why me? A simple answer would be fine. Oh, this is going to be hard. Oh, someone please send me a Hey, look at that. You need a power avenue straight in. Dragon's Keep. Oh, the bridge to the Dragon's Keep. <laughs> so, so that intense heat I'm feeling coming up under my hood. That would be the Lake of Molten Lava. Oh, the Lake of Molten Lava. Tom Key. We want to bring the bridge over the Lake of Molten Lava. Tom Key. Yeah. Just <laughs> stay calm and whatever you do, don't look down. I'm looking down, Shrek. I'm looking down. Oh, for the love of heat. I am frozen with terror. Tom Key, just take a step. I can't. Look in my eyes. I can't. Just take my hand. I can't. Now walk. Okay, but, but please don't let me go. Don't let me go, please. <laughs> I won't let you go. I won't let you go. If I do to deserve you, my power more. We crossed a bridge together. Oh, what a beautiful metaphor. Don't kill it. <laughs> 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 Whoa, Shrek, is that you, man? You gotta warn somebody. 
water before you just let one off like that. I mean, my mouth is open and everything. I told you, if it was me, you'd be dead. Believe me, it's brimstone. Oh, stop talking it's no brimstone. I know what that was, it was no dang brimstone. It ain't come from no stone neither. <laughs> now, look, donkey, I'm gonna try to find a helmet somewhere, and I'll be back in a minute, okay? Wait, 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 you, you mean you, you want me to wait here, like by myself? Unless you'd rather come slay the dragon and rescue the princess. Uh, not go away this far. But hurry back now, please. Oh man, this place is creepy. Woo! <laughs> what the? Yeah. Hey Shrek, come back. There are people. You don't want to wake her up. We get really mad. What the? Who are you people? We're the Disney princesses. What the? Oh man, I'm out of here. Oh no way, I'm good. <laughs>
Oh. oh my goodness. Oh. oh great. I get one of the snoozers. <laughs> wakey wakey! Are you Princess Fiona? I am. I'm waiting a night so bold as to rescue me. Oh, that's nice. Now let's go. Now hold this house tonight. I've long waited this moment, and I would have first like to know what's the name of my champion. Um Shrek. Sir Shrek, I pray that you take this favor as a token of my gratitude. Uh, thanks. So, where's the door? There is no door. What do you mean there's no door? How are we supposed to get down? Why, the same way you got up. The same way? Oh, come on, I just... Ugh. All right, let's go. Now hold this up tonight. Don't you want to savor this moment? It be of our first meeting. It must be a wonderful and romantic scene. Oh, no, you wouldn't. 
kissed. But how will you kiss me? Kiss you? <laughs> that wasn't in the job description. <laughs> no, it's destiny. A princess is rescued by a brave knight and they sure true love's first kiss. With Sred? You got to take it to a little kid. That's so funny. <laughs> well, princess, let's just say I'm not your type, okay? Of course you are. You're my rescuer. Now remove your helmet. Look, I really don't just think that's a good idea. Helmet. I'm not going take to. Take it off. No. Now. All right. As you command, your highness. Oh, you were expecting Prince Charming. Well, yes, actually. Oh, no. I'm supposed to be rescued by a brave knight, not some ogre and his pet. Oh, well, so much for seeing. <laughs> I'm not supposed to be an ogre. Look, Princess, I was sent to rescue you by Lord Farquaad, okay? He's the one who wants to marry then you. Then why didn't he come rescue me? Good question. You should ask him that when we get there tomorrow. Tomorrow? Oh my gosh, it's almost sunset. Uh, yeah, so? Uh, I didn't realize it was so late. We need to make camp. Camp? But you just escaped. Yes, and I found the whole ordeal quite exhausting. I need to rest immediately. Well, that's pretty unfortunate, Princess, because we're going to keep going. I need to find somewhere to camp right now! <laughs> Fine. <laughs> There's a cave right over there. Sure, right. that ain't no place for a princess. No, it's perfect. Well, gentlemen, I bid you good night. Hey, you want me to read you a bedtime story? Because I'm a little bit. I said good night. <laughs> she seems nice. <laughs> yeah. By day one way, by night another, this shall be the norm until you find true love's first kiss. And take love's true form. <sighs> and this is what I realized. If we escape the dragon, man, we can do anything. I could become a steed. Or I could work with the crusade circuit if I wanted to. You know, I could be even one of those horses that uh, that pull wagons full of beer. I need some uh, hair extensions on my ankles, but uh, I can do it. Uh, who would you want to be? I wouldn't want to be anyone. Well, but to, like, just for fun, though, like, who would you pick? I wouldn't. But like, if you had to. Don't. But, like, if a guy had a sword in your throat and was like, look here, you cannot be an ogre anymore. You can't be an <laughs> Then, who would you pick? I would pick that guy up and hurl him into a tree. <laughs> you are no fun at all, you know it. Is this what it's going to be like? You know, when we're done rescuing the princess, us sitting around in our swamp all day doing nothing? R swap. Donkey, there's no R, there's no we. There's just me and my swamp, and the first thing I'm gonna do when I get back is build a ten foot wall around my land. Well, dang. You cut me deep, Shrek. <laughs> you cut me real deep just now. <laughs> well, what's the problem anyway, huh? What you gotta get the whole world? Look, I'm not the one with the problem, okay? It's the world that seems to have a problem with me. You saw how that princess reacted. That's how it always is. They take one look at me and say, Oh, help! Big, stupid, ugly ogre! That's how it always is. They judge me before they even know me. But you know what, Shrek? When we met, I didn't think you were just some big, stupid, ugly ogre. Yeah, yeah I know. <sighs> so there's really no one else you'd rather be? Guess I'd be a hero with sword and armor clashing, looking for a semi dashing a shield within my grip. Or else I'd be a Viking and live a life of daring while smelling like a hero. Upon a Viking ship, I'd sail away. I'd see the world.
is known. And over always stays in the dark and all the Thank you.